If you have ever received a condition complaint for one of your ASINs or for a group of your ASINs, or you have ever been suspended, this video is for you. Okay, this is a real life case study. It's our case number 01772. Vin Famolaro was our senior paralegal assigned to the case. He got this seller's account reinstated with the very first plan of action he created, and it had to do with a condition complaint. So, the Amazon seller that hired us, and they hired us by using this case submission button at AmazonSellersLawyer.com. They submitted their case to us. They got a call back right away from our client relations team, and they hired us to write a plan of action for them to submit to Amazon. And the first plan of action worked, first swing at the plate, and it had to do with the use of great, great invoices. So when you receive an inauthentic or a condition complaint against an ASIN or a group of ASINs, your invoices are what is going to get you reinstated as quickly as possible. You always need to submit a plan of action with the root cause, immediate corrective action, long-term changes to your business, even if those sections don't really apply to you. That's how Amazon staff in India wants to receive the information from you. And then you gotta submit just killer invoices that persuade Amazon staff that the condition complaint or the inauthentic suspension should be lifted and you should get back into selling. And this is what you should know in advance of sourcing your products to try and make sure that your invoices that you're gonna get from your supplier have what Amazon wants in case you have a problem. 